guys, this is Betty Davis, the Bee Row Terrier. She is absolutely adorable today. She's getting a medium short haircut with a rounded face with a medium length beard, a tassel top ponytail, tipped ears, and a flag shaped tail. So let's get busy. We're going to start by cutting this band out of her top knot. There's a couple of things that you can use for taking a band out of a top knot. You can use a seam ripper. You can also use a pair of shears. Right, it's time to get Betty Davis in the tub. You're a good girl. You've got to get all clean. Yes, you do. You go get all clean and pretty and ready for Christmas. Yes, you want to be ready for Christmas, don't you? Oh, yeah, it's going to be so pretty. <laughs> You're an elf for Christmas. Boop, boop. <laughs> so cute. So cute, Betty Davis. Good girl. Mm, so sweet baby. Mm, so sweet, sweet baby. I am using Vetoquinol Ear Cleansing Solution in the ears. This dries up any moisture that may have gotten into the ears. It loosens up ear wax and debris. I fill up each ear canal and rub it into the ears and allow the dog to shake its head to remove the ear cleaning solution. Good girl. Next, I'm going to wrap her up in a nice warm towel and disinfect the tub with barbicide. The barbicide will be allowed to sit in the tub for at least 10 minutes before its next use. That will give the disinfectant sufficient time to do its job. This is the tumble dry setting. I am trimming and filing her nails as I blow dry her. This saves a few minutes during the blow dry 
and allows me to have easy access to the nails while the hair is wet. Using the Pa Brothers Extra Firm Pen Slicker Brush to brush out any knots that I find in her tail and in her legs. I will be using a 30 blade on the pads of the feet, a 15 blade on the tips of the ears, a 10 blade around the eyes and on the tummy, and a 10 blade under the tail.
to trim the trunk of the body, I'm going to clipper the body from the back of the head to the tail, around the rib cage, up under the dog, up the chest with a 5 8 HT blade. Next, I'm going to brush all this hair against the grain, meaning against the direction it grows, and then we'll clipper the entire trunk of the body again. This will help us have smoothness in our clipper work. I am skimming right down over the big thigh muscles, blending the body into the legs. Now I am clippering against the grain up the inside of all four legs. Next, by lifting the dog up, we're going to clipper the underside of the dog all the way up to the armpits. I clippered the front of the chest against the grain all the way up to the jawline. Now I'm going to comb down all the hair around the feet and scissor the feet round. It's a good girl. Mm -hmm. You're very good.
Now using Igram Magic Mist, I'm going to mist over the coat. Comb it all up. And blend the legs into the body. She gets a medium length beard squared off. Comb it down along the sides and even it up along the side. Combing the cheek hair up and back into the ears and rounding the beard into the ears.
On these longer beards, I tend to fold the ear in half and trim off anything that falls on the outside of the ear, rounding it up. I tilt the head downwards and scissor along this line with the hair tilted down. Do that on both sides. Next, combing the hair back from the back of the head, we're going to blend the head into the neck. Now I'm going to scissor the edges of the ears. Tilting the beard downward, I'm going to angle back so we don't have long pieces of hair falling off the front of the face. It's very helpful when a dog is eating to not have too much hair there. I'm going to mist over the top knot with I Grim Magic Mist. Comb it all back. Then using my rat tail comb, I'm going to go from the corner of one eye across to the corner of the other eye, combing all the hair together. I'm going to tie the band around three times. Then using a comb, I'm going to make sure that no skin was caught up in the band by sliding the comb under the band between the skin and the band itself. My next line will be right in front of the ears. I'm going to gather this hair together with the band in front. Mist over the hair just behind. Comb it in place. And put our second band in. This gives me a nice base for my bow. I'm going to put my bow right on top of this band. Next I comb all the hair up together and trim off the amount of hair equal to the amount that she's grown since her last haircut. This creates a tassel top ponytail, which fans out. It's very, very cute. Most of the products and tools that I used on Betty Davis today are listed in the description below this video. Betty Davis is all cleaned up and ready for the holidays. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to hit the notification bell. We'll see you next time, guys. Bye. Would you like a cookie, Betty? Oh, Betty wants a cookie. Good girl, here's a cookie. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum.
Take care. Say goodbye, Betty.